So tell me about what it's like here in Palm Desert. It is like a big breath of fresh air. So I actually live in Los Angeles and I come down here and as soon as you get into town, it's just literally like breathing fresh air. So there's a lot to do here. You've got nature and you've got all the stuff you love as a shopper and a diner, all intermingled and married together. Golf too? Lots of golf. <laughs> you've got golf, you've got tennis, you've got shopping on El Paseo. And what about here? We're at Flamingo Island right now. Flamingo Island, my favorite. This is one of the most photographed places in all of Palm Desert, really all of, all of the desert. And we're at the JW Marriott Desert Springs Resort and Spa. This place is special. There's a lot to do here. There's a lot to do here. They, <laughs> we like spa. Yeah. They have the biggest spa on the West Coast. They've got 36 holes of championship golf. Then they've got the, the entertainment zone, the JW Entertainment Zone, which I love. It's just a fun zone. It's super fun. They've got ski ball. They've got bowling. They've got virtual reality. All the things you love for the family. Do they have bars here? Oh, they have plenty of those as well. We should go <laughs> into one right now because I... <laughs> you've got to try something they've got going on. Let's do this. Okay, let's Thanks, go. Thanks, Okay, Don, tell me about this Frank Sinatra vibe I'm feeling here right now. <laughs> You're definitely picking up on the right vibes. I think it's the spirit of Sinatra here. So, yeah. Old Blue Eyes himself actually had his last concert right here at Desert Springs in the Grand Ballroom. They've actually renamed it now the Sinatra Bar. Okay, so they also have a drink named after him, too. You are right. It is called the Sinatra Smash, and I think it's pretty appropriately named because this guy, our Frank Sinatra, loved happy hour. So whenever it was cocktail o'clock to signify that, he had a big flagpole outside his house, and he'd hang a white flag to signify, hey, guys, we got to go get drinks. So therefore, Desert Springs is starting to do that, which I think is so cool. So fun. So cool. So iconic, just like the whole desert area. Yeah. And uh, they've even concocted this little Sinatra smash. So we've got, I think it's blackberries, fresh blackberries, creme de cassis. Um, we've got some, of course, Jack Daniels, because that was his favorite. Apparently, he only drank that. Yeah. That's what I've been told. Well, so can we wave the white flag right oh, now and see I if Hedger can make, her. make us one? Can we please <laughs> get one? I think we need one. We've got to have Malou try it. Ooh. Pretty please. Please. This is my first time trying the Sinatra Smash, so this is a special moment for us. All right, cheers, here. cheers, cheers. Oh, that's good, Hector. Oh my gosh, delicious. That's so good. The berry and the Jack Daniels. It's so good. You know, what I love about all this is that Desert Springs said that they wanted to create this drink as like the best is yet to come. That's oh. actually Frank's last song that he performed ever live. Oh, right here. That is so cool. Well, I, I can't also like not ignore what's going on over here with the food here, Don. No. I can see the flavors, the I color. That's sushi going on, and they have a world-famous, renowned, award-winning sushi bar. So it's one of my favorite places to get sushi in the whole desert. Don't fill up, though. Are we going to dinner after this? Uh, we got to go to dinner, and I'm going to take you on a gondola. Okay, okay. So we got to go off to dinner right now. Okay, thank okay. you. Cheers, cheers. Me too.